Hello all. Today we will see what the use of Microsoft OneDrive, what it is, why it is, and how it is used online and offline. Okay. So for first of all, you have to understand what is OneDrive. It is a cloud service from Microsoft. Now, what is cloud service? It is a you can say storage. Okay, instead of storing data on your hard disk, your pen drive, CD, etc., you can store your data on cloud storage. That provided by Microsoft. There, that is OneDrive, and you can access the same data from any device anywhere. So, what its benefits are? Anywhere access, you can edit, share your files on your device wherever you are. Backup and protect means suppose, for example, you lose your data. You want to, if you save the data on the OneDrive, you will not lose the data there. Means it helps to protect, or you can say creating a backup copy of that. Then same data or files can be shared and collaborate with the friends. In the real time, using Office apps, there, so you not require some large email attachments or thumb drives. We send there. So you can see, access all your OneDrive files in Windows 10 without taking up space on your PC. You are use your mobile device to scan, store, receive business card, etc. And you can store important files and photos with added layers of protection in OneDrive personal vault there. Now, these are all features of OneDrive. Now, see how we will use it. So, before using it, we have to log in there. First, I will tell you that how to use it uh, online. You can say through website. So, just click on sign in. As I'm having a login account, I can just sign in there. As you click on sign in, user provide username. And of course, password, as I already log in there, I'm not asking for a password there. Then you can see your OneDrive account will appear like this. So I am uh, having already my Microsoft Team account or Form account is there. So you can see the, all things will appear here. All the teams is showing here this side on the left side. And if you want to see all the apps, suppose I am using the Microsoft Form app. So I can see all the forms. You can see Microsoft Form and all the forms are created there with their particular names. Now you can open any of the form. For example, I click on half yearly, and uh, these are the files which submitted by some students of mine. And I can open these files and just uh, use it, edit them, and just send back to the students. Now this is what I can do with the online. Now we come to the offline method here. Means. I can install OneDrive in my computer or laptop also and I will work on my laptop or computer and then later on it will sync to your cloud. Now how it will sync? We require uh, one application for that so we can uh, sync that whatever work we are doing on your laptop or computer you can sync to the on online cloud storage or vice versa means from OneDrive to the computer or computer to the OneDrive. So if uh, you are having a Windows 10 that is already having cloud uh, that OneDrive uh, application in that. If you are not having that OneDrive application, syncing application, click on download there and you can get this option for download. You can just uh, click on download and OneDrive setup will exe file will just download there on your computer or laptop then click open file uh, 
and this is start installing as i am having already having the one drive by computer computer is showing us the message there otherwise it will complete it and you will get the one drive application installed in your computer or laptop there so now how to just uh, use it offline so just see type here one drive and you will get that one drive app okay as i click as i just click on that it will open the folder for me now i have to log in there okay as i am uh, already logged in here so how we log in there just right click on the clouds appearing in your notification area it may be gray color cloud or blue color cloud just right click on them and uh, it will open settings option there okay so suppose i am already having one account connected with that i want to add one more account so i click on add an account now provide your id click on sign in it will ask you for a password and when the setup complete you will see this thing will appear okay you can see on the left side some one drives okay i am having uh, three profiles there that is three times uh, shown there now i click on my profile that is uh, just now i done that you can see same option i am getting online i'll get offline also so i will show you that see this is my online options there and this is offline one so i can just show you here that uh, how you can work here you can see uh, the same things i am getting here so you will get that things here also you can see this is my hard drive folder that is you can use offline also okay and this is my online account of the one drive so now uh, you can just compare it app cyclic here microsoft forms app cyclic here microsoft forms there you can see the same things will appear there both the it means that you just you what what you done you just uh, create a syncing account which will have all the folders and files which you are having online on in our one drive now you can work with the help of your laptop you can work on uh, your laptop and desktop and just save that particular file it will appear in your cloud storage also so i will give you a demo for that suppose now this is my computer's uh, one drive account there one drive space so i just open any file there submitted by my uh, student submitted that during examination suppose this my student submitted this so i just open uh, this file it is a picture file so i will open with uh, some picture supported software suppose paint 3d is here so i can just open it you can see it is opening here and now i will just uh, do some correction with this picture depend on your net feed so see i select the plan here and uh, mark some i just edit that you can say annotate i just annotate them and uh, give some marks here okay now i close the file save it it is saving there so you can see i just now open file 
through my hard disk okay means uh, the folder of the one drive having on the hard disk from there i open the file and i save that now i minimize my online uh, that hard drive uh, space on the hard drive now i will open that same file in my one drive uh, online account click on half yearly questions and uh, see this is the questions that are just checked you can check it when you click on it you can see this is what i have done so i have done this all annotation on my one drive space on my laptop but you can see it will appear on my one drive space that is online okay this means what so one drive give you a power of working that is online or offline mode or you can say you can annotate any of the thing picture pdf etc and you can get the things done with the help of that thank you please like share and comment on my video thank you all